Hey sugars, it's Kenny. Thank you for visiting my channel. Today I am here in the ultimate safe file. So it is a gloomy day, you know, it doesn't look too, you know, bright and sunny. But I downloaded this save file because I watched, excuse me, I watched the video by Ocean Sims. Yes, um, for some reason I wasn't sure, but yeah. <laughs> I was watching the video by Ocean, Ocean Sims, how she said that she wouldn't want to play in New Crest if it didn't look like this. And honestly, it does look good. So this is one of the little neighborhoods and it looks so like, you know how the Sims likes to have lots so spaced out and it looks so unrealistic. But this creator used the YouTube mod and all that good stuff to make it things more cohesive and make it look like a neighborhood so this is the home by not by this is the home i chose for oh hold on one second i had to get the chimney up there <laughs> this is the home i chose for yuri and lizette and i'm gonna give you a little tour um they everything was previously decorated um but i decided to basically I shouldn't say I got it the inside, but I did take out all the decor and furnishings of the interior besides, I think, the bathrooms. In the bathrooms, I might have taken down things that were on the wall like, or like if they had a, um, a bath mat down, I most likely took that out. But I redid everything. So I'm going to give you guys a tour. Let's meet at the front door. Welcome to our crib. So once you go inside, hopefully all the walls are up because sometimes I forget. <laughs> but once you go inside the steps are here and then you go to the left and it is their kitchen i decided to put a small little um <clears throat> excuse me a small dining space here um this is a cc table i think cc chairs for sure too and then just a few things now this home isn't fully decorated because i wanted it to seem like they haven't been living here long and then also <clears throat> they plan on extending their fam family a bit more so yeah um i didn't want to put too much in here because once they have kids they'll probably want to add stuff so i added the pot and pans here the little um what's this thing called that thing uh what holder <laughs> I don't know. I had a little wine rack. Um, that, I believe, came from... Let me not lie to you. I'll try to put links in the description. Because I never remember anything. I put, a couple, I put some paper towel on the wall. And then a uh, dish drying towel up there as well. This little plant. I was going to say flowers, but it's just it's looking like plants. So then once you go through this way, which if you go back to the front door and go right, you will end up here. And this is my girl, hey, Lisette. She's playing The Sims. What, what is she playing? Why have I never seen? What is this? Why am I new? I'm new to this. So this isn't her computer. This is actually her husband's computer, but maybe she, or maybe it is hers. I thought I made it for her husband. I don't know, but anyway, she's here playing. So this is their living space. And I didn't, again, I didn't want to put too much, but I wanted it to look like, you know, they tried to do a little bit. And if you watch the cast video of them, I did say that she likes to thrift. So not everything will match. Not all the woods will match. And I did that on purpose because if you're thrifting, it's not a guarantee that you'll find things that match, but they'll look good, you know, and they'll probably be better quality. Anyway, so I put a little decor behind the couch. I did some plants. I tried to do plants everywhere. I'm not saying she has a green thumb, but I kind of want her to have a green thumb. We'll see how it goes. I have a little stroller for the little baby. I think, why does it look like this is a fake stroller? Like it's supposed to be a little kid's toy stroller? girl it probably is <laughs> and then i have some shoes and coat rack and everything yuri likes to wear hats so this is his baseball hat and that is lizette's um sun hat some boots all right so like i said you come back in to the steps so it's just the big old circle 
and we can go outside i'll let us go outside it's I don't think I put anything out here yet because I don't really know what they'll have. Again, it's just them two. They don't really have any friends out here. They don't have family that I've created, at least not yet. So we have a little sofa, a little seat out there, and then it's just, it's just outdoors. So let's stop floating. And then we'll I'll meet you guys upstairs. Once you come upstairs, this is the like landing just where all the doors are nothing's open it's a little bit of space we could put like clutter and um storage and stuff out here this first door to the left hey yuri i didn't even know he was in here i just literally came into the game a few seconds ago a few minutes ago anyway i put a little clutter on their on their counters you know nothing crazy they have a dry towel there it looks kind of big i might make that smaller because i intended it just to be for hands so that's kind of big and then this all this is the same i think i changed the um swatch of the toilet and then i put a little toilet brush over here i need to get them a plunger but you know We'll get there. And then once you come back out that door, then you go into this one. And this is their bedroom. So, um, again, she's a thrifter. She thrifter. She likes to go to the thrift shops and get things. So this um, dresser is from the thrift store. She has a small TV up here. Um, they do have a baby monitor. The baby's not born yet, but they're prepared, okay? A little plant, a seating area because Yuri likes to read. I kind of think that Lizette will get into reading with him. Like, you know he'll recommend books to her and she'll be like okay let me just try it out sounds good because she likes to learn and explore things as well so books are fun they have a little um what is it uh next you sleeper i forget what they're called you know it's a little sleeper thing for the for the baby once it's born or i should say he we know what it is it's a boy once he's born he'll be able to sleep over there next to his mommy so she can easily breastfeed so she doesn't have to you know go all the way into his nursery they have an alarm clock and their remote for the tv and then this i love this i can't tell you who it's by for some reason i want to say pierre sim but i could be wrong that sleeper is by my cup of cc and then i have this okay these are the emotion or um i don't know the real name by charlie pancakes candles but i thought this color would match we're just not gonna ever let the emotion <laughs> do what it's supposed to do then we just have some clutter and some more plants um up here so let's go back into this hallway so if you see this room and that room over there they're completely empty they have the flooring and wallpaper all that but it's for a future baby or, you know, maybe a family member will visit and they might make it a guest room. I'm not sure. But if we go into this room, it's my favorite room. Oh, oh sorry. So this is the nursery. I just put a whole bunch of stuff. I just imagine Yuri and Lizette just wanted to buy whatever they could find for the baby. It's some thrifted stuff, some new stuff, some gifted things before they move. So it's just you know and then crazy thing is i also said this in the cast video i didn't know if it was going to be a boy or girl but for some reason i really wanted this room to be blue so that's that's a, a, a consistent color in here it's not like the whole room is blue but it's definitely a color that you can notice everywhere um i wanted it to look like it wasn't like an ikea type of nursery or super modern i this is the only thing that might look a little maybe modern newish you know and i put that there because this is a crib for an infant but we need a space for the newborn besides just their bedroom you know they, they might want to have some mommy and daddy time so they don't want the baby in there all the time i just got toys everywhere i've i see video not videos pictures on tumblr of different kids rooms and it's just so cluttered with toys and stuff and i'm like why don't i ever do that because in reality I feel like kids should have all types of toys, all types of learning things in their rooms. It shouldn't just be a toy box. It's never going to be a time where kids are like, oh, I'm done with this toy. Let me put it back in my toy box. How many kids do that consistently? 
Now, you probably do have some kids that are just neat freaks, you know, but that's rare, okay? And again, I said they have a monitor, so this is the um, baby monitor that will look over the crib once their water one gets in their crib. So, yeah, this is the nursery. I really like it. <laughs> I, again, I just started decorating and crazy enough it was a boy so you know how the blue is for boys pink is for girls thing that wasn't my attention but that's and it's still not super masculine you know it's not a whole bunch of like kickboxing and cars <laughs> but i just wanted it to be a kid's room it doesn't matter what the you know gender is but again, these two rooms are for some future little ones. And actually, if we go back into this room, if you really notice, this is a big space. Big enough for more than one kid. Um, the other rooms, ooh, I'm kind of, I'm a tall person. <laughs> Once you go, oh, it's dark. These rooms are a little smaller, and that's why I decided to have that room be the first kid's room. Um, I turned the light on. I'm surprised. But both of these rooms are smaller than the other we were about to fall down the stairs y'all <laughs> but um i just thought that would be nice and also i didn't show you the bathroom Ooh, my nose is itching i didn't show the bathroom downstairs but um it's basically the same as this one it's just a little smaller let's say hi to yuri again it's a little smaller and i didn't really um decorate it. i mean clutter it up i put a bath mat i believe i don't okay i'll just take you down there so the other bathroom i'm in i'm on the table the other bathroom is through this door behind the couch, behind the living space. And like I said, the one upstairs is just a little bigger, but we have a shower. It used to be, so I did change this a little bit. It was a shower tub combo at first, but then I was like, I really want um, a washer and dryer in here. So I threw a shower just so it's an extra cleaning space, but they could also have their washer and dryer. Then we have the, you know, toilet the sink space so we i could put some stuff here but most likely we'll just put like a plant here for decor and maybe something to smell good but yeah this is their home i i was like something's missing <laughs> a little curtain um i kind of feel like i should do a longer curtain but you know we might change it up as time passes but i'm just excited to play with this family i'm excited to see how i expand this place not really expand but add more decor and clutter well, we have a little um high chair here uh like i said i just wanted things to look like she got it from a thrift store and not everything came from a name brand ikea Ashley's furniture type of store because sometimes you don't want to spend all your money on furniture but I'm just going in circles so let's go ahead back outside I didn't do anything I don't think I did anything yeah I didn't do anything to this porch but it's a big old porch okay the kids can have their toys out here you know it can, it's enough space for some things and I really like that I like how they did the steps because it's two i was gonna say two layers but is that really how you say that but this is their um block this is their street i really like how it looks um their home is right there but you know the tool my adds so much to the well i shouldn't say the tool my but creators using the tool my helps add so much to the worlds and it just looks so much better i can't even lie when i saw this i was like oh I want to have a family in that in the neighborhood okay i copied the same neighborhood that ocean sim was talking about other neighborhoods are completed in this file say i think all of them are done i think so you know if you haven't downloaded it already go ahead and do that i'm about to be playing here i can't wait to play with this family but i don't want to rush it you know i don't want to do too much because i want to make sure i like the story and make sure i'm enjoying it and if i'm enjoying it i know you guys will so yeah thank you so much for visiting my channel if you enjoyed your stay please give me a like and chat with me in the comments and i will chat with you in my next video bye